All right, guys, it's the end of May. Turkey season's winding on down for us here and really starting to shift focus into deer. I just wanted to take a quick moment and talk about the saddle that I used last year. This is the Dry Rad Dre saddle, the full size one with the Mutiny belt. I really like this saddle. I hunted out of it a bunch, killed a lot of deer out of it. This year, I went down to Tennessee to hunt with Dane and let me test out the new Mini. So this is the Mini with the little burr pouch and the kill deer harness. So this will be my setup that I'm rocking this year. And honestly, this thing is gonna be a game changer. So this video, I just kind of wanted to show the differences between the two, as you can see, real big differences just on the pouch alone. But let's unpackage them and get into it. All right, so got the kill deer harness on right now. This is basically the bird pouch. This is what you'll hold the mini in. Pull it out. Here's my leg straps. I'll put them on in a second. And then here's the mini. The main differences between the Dre and uh, the new mini is it's fully detachable from the pouch. The old one was sewn into the pouch, so you couldn't actually pull it apart. It kind of just stayed in there. But let's put it on and get up a tree. Just like that, I'm saddle hunting. Uh, the only thing I'm missing is off of this belay loop. I'm supposed to have a carabiner and a pressing knot on this, and that's kind of my backup. But for this example, I didn't bring mine. So for hunting purposes, I'll have it on though. Differences between the Dre and the Mini is the new strap bridge they got. They went away with the old amp steel bridge and did this strap bridge. Once again, it's fully adjustable, so you can you know, customize it to your comfort, however you like it. Another difference on the Mini is the back support. They went away with the amp steel back support and put on the strap back support. It does the same thing, besides it's a little bit more low profile. The old one was like from here and it attached to your bridge and you adjusted your back support like that. It was all right, but when you're shooting bow, you had to watch that bottom Merp. string there in case it caught Merp. on that amp steel. So kind of like this, a little bit better. Really the main difference between the full size Dre and the Mini is the size. You can see, really small, which I like. Last deer season, this is exactly how I wore that full size Dre. I just had it tucked up under, you know, mid thigh height, mid back height, and that's how I rocked it, which I really like this style. All right, well, there you have it. That's kind of the main differences between the original Dre and this Mini. Overall, I love this thing. I cannot wait to hunt out of it. This thing is super light, super compact. You know, it packs up basically nothing into my pack. And I mean, it's great for kneelers or standers. I'm mostly a stander, so I'll probably be standing out of it a bunch. But yeah, I cannot wait to hunt out of it this fall. If you guys are interested in buying one, we got a little discount code to save you some money. I think it saves you like 10%. So if you click the description of this video, that code will pop up for you. But thanks for watching, guys. See you on the next one.